so <clears throat> I said I'm gonna go live because it seemed like people would be big mad not little mad big mad big mad and some of the things I be talking about some of the topics maybe some of the way I present some of my ideas I get messages from individuals that say things like you need to keep studying I ain't never studied how can I keep studying if I've never studied any of this stuff that I speak on. Study would, I mean, I don't have really the dictionary in front of me. I like to bring break down these words by what y'all define them as, but studying would apply that I was like being, being taught. But I don't look at this as being taught. I look at this as I create, okay, let's, let's break this down, simply. I look at this as creator, creation there was a time I was too busy being a creator meaning I've never lived or experienced my own creation just too busy being a creator now I'm in my creation so I am just remembering what I created I don't have to study myself because I am myself. I don't have to study my own creation because I am the creator of that which I am in. People get mad because I don't say how they've been taught. People get mad because I'm not regurgitating some shit that came out of a book. People be big mad. And I would be mad too if I spent all my time and all my essence and all my life where the head in a book and still don't know some shit. I would be upset if I've literally dedicated tons of money to different forms of education for them to tell me I'm smart. I would be big mad. I understand. I can understand why people would be upset with me. I'm just a reflection of what you are capable of achieving. Inner knowledge. It don't gotta make sense to you. It don't even always make sense to me. You think these videos are about you. These videos are not about you. These videos are about me. I make these videos so I can articulate some of the thoughts verbally. Sometimes I think some shit and I don't say it. So instead of me just thinking it, I decide to think and speak it. Therefore, I can go back to it. Re-remember it. Listen to myself. Analyze myself. This is what I do with everything. I analyze everything that's connected to me. So if you're coming on my stream, coming on my lives, to talk your truth, then create your own live, in your own groups, in your own streams to do that. I'm not stopping you. But if you're coming on my lines, in my stream or my channel, well, let's ask this question. Did I call on you or did you call on me? Did I come to your channel or did you come to my channel? <laughs> I didn't call on you. You called on me. That's why you came to my channel. So if you're a big man, for whatever the things that I say or how I say it or me being incorrect or me being wrong or all that shit. Do something about it. If you big mad, you big angry, do some shit. Create a channel, create a live, create a following, do the same shit I did. <laughs> Hopefully, me pissing you the fuck off will make you do something. And I told you, anger gets shit done. So hopefully me saying some shit wrong, me saying it the wrong way, will put you on the right path. Then maybe you'll be little man.
<laughs> and you won't be big man. <clears throat> Glad you make these videos, brother. I appreciate it, you know? See, but I'm only as good as the energy I receive. So now I'm not only making these videos for me, I'm making these videos for the energy that I'm receiving. Like you guys. Big angry. Yeah, they be big mad, little mad. Figure out what you guys are. If I'm making you big mad, then that's a shame that you letting some stranger <laughs> that you never even met, that you have no clue about, that you have no, shouldn't have any connection with if you big mad, but yet he making you big mad. So that's on you. It's on you that you let someone vampirize your energy that much. Uh, those people who think they know but don't know. I mean, okay, this is true. I mean, because you have to understand and know a thing. What? This is how I, I try to explain to people. <clears throat> You're a channel. Most of these people that are highly informed are really tuned into a channel. Or a movie. So how do we explain this? <laughs> We're in a house. 30 screens in this house. Each house, I mean, each screen is displaying a different emotion or channel, story. So you can be the individual that runs around the house and gets a glimpse of all the stories. So, you know, in a sense, you have an overview of all of the different stories that are going on in the house. But you can also be an individual that gets glued, stops on one story or one screen. Now you're glued in. So now you're rewatching the movie over and over again. You're pulling up different points. You're analyzing, you're glued in. You have so much information now about that movie. Congratulations, you know a thing. And you know that one thing. But you think you the shit. Cause you know what you did? You done increased the size of your television. You used to watch your little story on a 19 inch. And then you done grew it now it's 24 now you done grew it now it's fucking 70 inches now it's the whole goddamn wall before you know it, it might be half your house half the whole house fuck the whole house might be holographically projecting this one story now because that's how glued in you are so it ain't my fault you done masked all the 29 stories that's around you or you done dedicated all your time and effort to only know one story it's not my fault you did that you big mad because you made everything big it didn't Minimize it so you can see the bigger picture. You macro mad. You're not micro mad. You macro mad. You big mad. That's not my fault. And then it gets even deeper. I tell the motherfucker I'm not even the television. I am the house that's containing all 30 of these televisions. I can glue in, tune in, disconnect, unplug, throw the fucking TV out. I have all these authorities when it's my fucking house, but you don't even see that. Yeah, I just see Big Mac because you glued into Spartans on this 300 inch TV. Okay, anyway. I'm here, uh, uh, Mini Mad. <laughs> Mini Mad. Yeah, 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 they Big Mad, Mini Mad, Little Mad. That just means they were never here for knowledge but attention. This is very true, you know, but whose attention? Like I said. I didn't call on them. They called on me. So the way that they're getting my attention is in a trolling behavior or or you don't know what you're talking about. So then that must have been, and this is how I acknowledge things. I must have done that to that energy in a past life. Whatever energy got him big mad right now is making him type all this shit and not do something else in the life. I must have pissed him off somehow, some way. So now he's regurgitating that energy or reflecting that energy. Made him big mad in the past. He's trying to make me, I mean, little mad in the in the present, you know. But he's trying to get my attention because I guess that's how I got his attention in the past. It's deep, you know. But I'm I am not who I was yesterday. So if you're still mad at me for who I was yesterday, then you're not understanding the power of now. But that's a whole another conversation. Uh, you don't anger me. You open my mind and help me think. Of some shit that could sometimes be beyond <laughs> Hold on Can be uh, Beyond my intelligence But at the same time I've always knew more But never really expressed it But 
you are in a way express this my understanding from yes 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 I do yes that's but that's what I'm trying to do we're trying to make things that have been extremely complicated and confusing <laughs> to all of us as simple as possible so they're big mad because they've spent eight years or or here's an example they're big mad because they go to school for eight years to be a therapist or go to school eight years to get a hip hypnosis license even in the state of Louisiana, you don't need one. But they're big mad because they have to do all that just so they can get $55 an hour. But I didn't have to do all that. I learned it myself. I fucking <laughs> learned it all myself. And now I'm able to not have to go to school for eight years and call myself a therapist, a metaphysical therapist, and have these titles and things like that based on the application and me performing the duties. I'm, I'm sitting now in a brand new template how did you be a therapist and don't have a degree? I am a therapist and I have no degree. And you do not have to have a degree or license in the state of Louisiana to, pa uh, to perform hypnotherapy. So I'm good. But they're big mad because like I said, they spend so much time dedicating or giving off their life or light and not holding on to it. It's not my fault you're a big man. I appreciate y'all gifts. Your, your gift is, is is your presence. A present, presence. You being here is a gift to me. Why? Because I'm only as good as the energy I receive. So if you gift me with your presence, that's the biggest gift that you could give me. The question is, how do you keep your presence with someone if you're no longer with them? But we don't know about transmutation. So you don't see... I love you group here here's ten dollars because I love you I love you idea of me loving you being trapped in this money and I'm giving you this money transferring my consciousness of my love to you now how am I loving you I'm giving you information I'm 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 growing you spiritually mentally emotionally physically I'm not just touching you I'm not just just kissing you I'm not just buying you some shit like we're going beyond that so because I'm showing you a different way of love I, you keep me with you how because you're spending my money when I give you this this is helping you eat it's helping you grow it's helping you keep me with you presence so this is why money is presence presence because you're gifting your presence it doesn't have to be money I'm just giving the idea that you put put things Put, you put your, your consciousness in things. I am putting my consciousness in this video. This is a thing. I'm giving you my consciousness. I'm giving you a piece of me. You know, I'm letting you keep me with you. Because when I hit finish, you can hit play over and watch it again. And watch it again. And do as much shit as you want to this video as possible. This is the concept of gifting someone with a presence. With an energy. Yes, energy is money. So how are you using this energy? What are you doing with this energy? I appreciate your time and your knowledge and just everything. And I keep uh, presence of others with me when they aren't around. Yes, that's smart. Uh, through thought and energy has no real limitations in space. Yes, indeed. So once you realize that you don't have to keep an item with you to keep someone's presence with you. How do you know? Well, when someone dies, which is their presence, their gift, their body, their presence, and when they're no longer there or present, present, get all these words together, guys, one swoop, let's be smart, we're all in the present, okay, they're gifting you with their presence, and when they no longer have their presence, their body, so what, they don't matter no more, fuck them, who cares, it don't work like that. You still acknowledge them. You're still acknowledging that energy even when the presence is gone. But are you acknowledging an energy even when the presence is gone? So when that man no longer is paying for your shit, are you acknowledging him? Or because his presence is gone, he don't fucking matter. Or because I'm not making videos for you guys every day, are you acknowledging me? Or because my presence isn't with you? Or I'm not making videos for you guys. I'm making you feel a certain way every day. Are you still with me? It ain't on me. It's on you to ask that question. 
<clears throat> or far more. Yeah, time, synergy. But you gotta remember that you're spending your time making money. So time and money are very, very um, in sync. Very, 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 very in sync. More unstable money becomes, more unstable time becomes. Mandela effect. Bitcoin. Wall Street crashes. I mean, we can kind of get the ideologies a little more. Um, no, you never, you never get time back. Um, you never get time back. You don't want your presence to be backed in time. That can make more sense for you guys. If you keep your presence backed, and you're keeping your present, presence, present moment backed, meaning in yesterday. So y'all still mad at me about being big mad about some shit I did in y'all past lives, huh? So y'all gonna come on my lives and come on my streams and talk shit because y'all big mad about your backed time. Or how you feel like I backed up your time or restricted your time from past lives. So you're big mad now in the present. Um, what, the vessel may be six feet under, but the spirit within the vessel or something they really love like songs, clothes, memories. You radiate, dude. You don't, you don't, you ooze. <laughs> you ooze your light or chi out of you. And then it gets captured in objects. But you ain't just who you are right now. me come back on huh? well I'll be in your presence thank you and I will be in yours and we would treat each day like a gift because we're giving each other gifts what are gifts I try to show you the science of your four it's a box it's, it's, it's the start of your square you open up your square you open up your box you're giving out gifts gifts of the spirit gifts of the light gifts of the crystal Yeah, so that was probably it. Just, you know, give you guys a little overview on why certain energies, because this doesn't just apply to me, this applies to you. Why there might be energies around you that might be big mad, little mad. Why there's energies around you that want to get your attention, whether it's them pissed off or them saying fuck you or I hate you or, okay. I mean, you got to look how I perceive things. Now, I deleted the message just because it serves no purpose on, I have a positive video, and here you come being a negative Nancy, you know, so the comments serve no purpose, if it served a purpose, or, or, I mean, because basically you're just like, you're wrong, you don't know what you're talking about, fucking study some shit, okay, why am I wrong, why don't I know what I'm talking about? Like, add detail. Give me some depth. I fucking make a whole video for 47 minutes, and then you just go to say some shit in four seconds and be like, oh, yeah, ha, huh. huh. I'm done. I said some shit. <laughs> okay. Like, all right. You know, add some depth in what you're saying. You know, if you're going to say some shit up here, make sure, you know, it can resonate with the statement you're saying. And then, you know, hold some weight to what it is you're saying. If I don't know what I'm talking about, then why? Why is it, you know, you believe I don't know what I'm talking about? You know, so that's it. Um, yeah, I mean, it's funny. Santa Claus. <laughs> yeah, I ain't even gonna get into that.
Google what a clause is. Isn't a clause like a statement? I don't know. All right, that's it. Appreciate it. Attention seekers. Yeah. Yeah. It's all right. They, they need us. So don't like, um, don't shun them. Don't push them away. They need us. So appreciate it. You know, I'm still in Facebook jail. So I'm gonna make these little random videos until they let me out. Free Q!